Uh, Alright guys, um, I think I need to re-record this video, I did it already once, um, I need to bring in more structure in my videos. So this is the intro part, where we'll go over the stuff I'll talk about. I'll talk about how you get your cookie, what I have been adding to the bot most recently, and obviously I will showcase what I've added to the bot most recently. So um, yeah. Let's get started. What has been added to the bot most recently? I think, uh, hold on, give me one second. I need to restart the bot real quick. So whenever you want to know what are, what is new in the bot or what are the changes, use the slash change log command. That's like the best part where you have the most um, accurate information of what, of what has been added, what has been added to the bot. We've, we've had added um, image generation for player profiles which is the player profile card. And we had added um, Poyolet support, right? If we go into my DMs here to today's leaf bot, as you can see, I've been getting every single day, you've claimed X amount of uh, rewards this month. This has been going on for a while now, as you can see right here. Um, here in the um, but FAQ, uh, I'm sincerely sorry for my inability to code due to my lack of experience, blah, blah, blah. I basically uh, admitted I made a mistake. And people actually hit me up and were like, yo, I can't do this. This is not working. And I was like, obviously, um, telling them, yeah, guys, I made a video on how to get your cookie. It's not that hard. When in actuality, it was my fault. So I'm sincerely sorry for that. But to go, to go over getting cookies, I've made a video on it. Um, we will watch the part again because people keep asking me where I can find the cookie. So now we have a more compact video. Um, we can listen to it uh, really quick. It's like, what? It's me rambling on. It's like 30 seconds. So uh, let's watch it. You can do in the Hoyle Lab interface. So now if I hit, before I forget, um, the here the script can be found here. If you go to the description, right, and you want the uh, script, cookie script is here. Click on the second link. Enter. It will show me my cookie, and then there's a little button here says that says click here to copy. Make sure to hit that. You can also get your cookie on mobile. For that you just open your Chrome on your phone and make sure in the um, Chrome options you activate desktop site and then you'll be able to grab your cookie too. All right, that is false. Let me show you how it's actually done. Um, for cookie grabbing on mobile, I made a YouTube short for that. Um, we can actually listen to that. All right, guys. So here is how you get your cookie. You copy the script. You'll go back to oilab.com. You don't need to activate desktop site. Um, now you go to the URL bar, you hit space, then paste the script, and then you, you get your cookie. All right, back to Discord. Um, I don't think it's necessary to go over the profile card command because it's not really part of Hoya Lab. So the next one is the slash dailies command. That's also explained in the first video I made. Um, I will probably link it in a card where you can just watch the full video if you're really interested in it. What essentially it does here, as you can see right here, if we send it, it's not actually a command, it's just a submission form where you can enter your user ID and they hold your lab cookie, which we watched earlier how you can get it, right? Um, if you do that, automatically after that, you will receive a uh, Hoya Lab daily login, right? It will claim the current day for you and it will display these two messages. Um, if you don't get these two messages immediately, it means your cookie was invalid or something went wrong. And then you should probably log out of Hoya Lab, re-log in and then grab the cookie before you submit it to the bot. On top of that, after the daily login came in, I was able to add a bunch of features. So we can go through this one. I don't think I mentioned this in a video already. I had a slash schedule command. Um, what it allows us to do is uh, we have a little Genshin Impact overview um, in terms of uh, schedule times, but uh, is basically going on on our account, the current resident, this is actually accurate to in-game. Um, yeah, and based on that you can build uh, reminders. Um, and I, because uh, I'm such a nice person, I allow people to actually, uh, yeah, well, uh, check other users' uh, schedule. So we can check potatoes, um, your potatoes' uh, own account. Um, your expeditions have already returned, uh, Rip Potato just went uh, to sleep. So, let's do another time to change lock command. I, as always, very professional over here. <laughs> so, um, the next one, which is not even in the list here because I forgot about it, is the Hoya stat. 
it's like a little overview of her quote um account stats where it tells you how many chests you've collected how many exquisite chests you've collected precious chests various chests remarkables um then the oculi which i have my account right now how many characters i have how many achievements i have what region this account profile is based on how many days my account has been active which is about to hit 900 days which is actually impressive and this also works again on the, on people you mentioned who are leaked to the system right i don't know if i added support here for the uh, multi account thing it may okay yeah, it works here um i just forgot it on the other command um all right the next thing we do the change log command again um here we have the slash schedule which we already went over on the higher stats we already went over so that's pretty good now is the new stuff uh, which happened added yesterday this is the um character list man what does it do prints a uh, character overview for yourself again all these accounts uh all these commands work with uh viewing it from other link users just so you know just send the slash character list command it will generate an image um depending on the bots load right now on how many people are actively using the image generation time fluctuates here's my character list overview um this works again works on other users pretty much gonna um, print it out in a second and yeah that's potatoes character overview fantastic now next thing um is the spiral part all right this is a lineup overview however you want to call it this has no weapon info no artifact info just you know the teams and the clearance um if you haven't cleared it it will give you an error aka you haven't progressed this far um blah 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 right or the user you check and if the user doesn't have it cleared uh, the, the, the same error will appear too those are the things i've been adding if you like this, um, if you like these additions, make sure to use the bot. It's very simple to invite the bot. Um, all you gotta do is uh, bit.ly dot, uh, well, bit .ly slash Dane underscore bot. It will lead you to the uh, .gg page where you can, if you want to, um, upvote the bot, for example. Um, if you don't want to, you don't have to, obviously. Um, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Actually, if you want to support the development of this bot, um, I don't know. Maybe consider you getting the bot premium. Obviously, you don't have to. This is completely for free to use the bot. But if you want to help out a little bit, this is a way to support the bot development, me and Potato. And yeah, I appreciate you guys. And yeah, catch you later.